Hey guys, what's up? This is Cameron from AppOSX.com and today I'm going to be showing you how to jailbreak your iPhone 3GS running iOS 4. Um, there are some restrictions to this jailbreak, so I'm going to go over those right now. The first one is that your iPhone 3GS must currently be running 3.1.2 jailbroken with any jailbreak software besides Spirit. Spirit, um, for whatever reason, will not work to upgrade to iOS 4. Your iPhone 3GS most must also have the old boot ROM, which means you purchase your 3GS between um, release date and around September um, of 2009. So it must have the old boot ROM too. So here I'm going to show you how to jailbreak it right now on Windows. So here we go. So what you need to do is you need to go down to your uh, whatever, your browser, and you need to go to this website, which will also be in the description. It's the I uh, Hate Snow website. So you need to download Snow Breeze. For Windows. So we're going to download that and when it's downloaded you need to um, go ahead and launch up the application which I have right here. Launch it wherever you save it just open it and when it opens up it says okay this software is not recommended for commercial use. Okay we're gonna hit next and you can do either simple or expert mode. I'm gonna go ahead and show you expert mode. All right, we're going to find the IPSW4 file. And to download the firmware, I'll give you a link to download the firmware in the description. So, yeah. So I'm going to select iPhone 2, 1, 4.0 restores. That's the iPhone 3GS. Let it process. And it says, notice, Snowbreeze has detected this device cannot be jailbroken with SnowGees unless it's already jailbroken. So like I said, um, use it says if you're on Spirit using the old boot ROM, click here. Um, that means you cannot jailbreak. So he, this iPhone 3GS right here happens to be the old boot ROM since it was purchased about a week after launch. So once you've selected the file, we're going to hit next. And we're going to go ahead and go into the general tab. And we're going to um, hit the blue arrow. And these are things that you can choose to do. You can activate the phone if you're um, using an unofficial carrier. You can enable background wallpaper which isn't needed on the 3GS, battery percentage, which isn't needed on the 3GS, multitasking, which isn't needed on the 3GS, and make IPSW NOR only. Um, you can choose that, and you can also choose your partition size. So you hit the next button. Um, here we go. This says um, that you can use Ultra Snow. Okay, so you're going to go ahead and click Cydia. You can also check Rock. I'm going to go ahead and check Rock. Um, you can do custom packages, I'm not going to bother with that, custom boot logos, and yeah. So when you're done, you're just going to hit build IPSW. So you're going to let it build really quickly right here. It usually takes around, oh, I don't know, about five, five to ten minutes. It kind of depends on your computer. So yeah, I'll be back once it's done running all this. Alright guys, I'm back, and um, the, it's almost done. It's creating the IPSW. This is the last step. The bar is sitting at about 90%. I know you can't see it, but um, it's almost there. Done cleaning up, and done. Okay, Snowbreeze seems to have successfully created your IPSW. Now you need to connect your iPhone 3GS, which make sure it's plugged into your computer, um, enter recovery mode and it will uh, it will do the jailbreak unfortunately this iPhone 3GS is already jailbroken so we cannot do the tutorial for you today but um, yeah so it's a simple process from there you simply uh, hit OK shift put in recovery mode then shift click restore um, and iTunes to that custom restore file and when you're done you'll restore into a new jailbroken device running iOS 4 um, so that's it. Please rate, comment, subscribe, follow us on Twitter, visit our website, and check out our store that should be up now. Thanks.